Headed on a road trip, let's go, let's go Washing every town we dip on the past You're in charge of the tunes Okay, uh, just a quick one. Um, about a kilometre from the uh, Mount Fox camping grounds. Go past the school, down the road, Mount Fox Road, past the school. And uh, as you can see here is a um, dirt road starts and a grid bridge. And the Mount Fox crater is off to the left. Okay, so I uh, haven't been in here before, but the crater looks really... I took the drone up last night and had a look at the... Uh, the crater, it looks fantastic, so it'd be really good to see how it looks up nice and close. But, um, there you go, the short little gate, and away you go, and just remember when you're in the bush, always leave gates how you found them, okay? But I'll, I'll put the drone up when I get to the, um, the crater, and we'll have a, have a closer look.
Lake Mount Fox and we're taking the back road to towards Hidden Valley and then I think we're going to circumvent around to the Burdekin. Yep, yes. should come out near the Star River on um, Harvey's Range Road, turn right, we'll go up to across the Burdekin on the Gregory Development Road, across the Charles Towers, uh, refuel and then go to Burdekin Dam. Spent a few nights up there. This is the back road through uh, Zigzag Station. So, um, yeah, a couple of creek crossings, um, a lot of bad weather through here about a month ago, but it should be right now. Just spoke to the uh, Royal, um, uh, the uh, fire brigades, and they said it's all good. <coughs> Air's travelling very well. Ten dogs falling over. No, it's falling over, is he? Yep, it's a bit Sur rough. Surprised. Spent um, five or six days up at Mount Fox and then across to um, Burdekin Dam uh, over the Easter holidays. The ton of people up here on, on the Easter holidays, um, the place is packed. I, I don't think there's any uh, one more spot really available, but um, as you can see, looking around now, uh, what is it, um, Monday morning, 11 o'clock, and the place is pretty well, pretty well empty now. A few people parked up, um, nearly everyone's gone, so we're going to go go home today and get a couple of things sorted out. Um, the band booked in for a, um, a service on on uh, Wednesday morning, so we're going to get that done, get the bearings done, and find how to do it, write down all the bearing numbers, and um, keep them on file so we know what to write, and get a spare set as well, so when we are on the road, um, we'll be able to um, do our own bearing replacements on the road if we need to or if we do a bearing we better have a replacement there for it always a good idea to carry some spares and make sure you get the numbers off the bearings that come off your van because they're all different um yeah while we're here we're actually plugged into power and water is really good so there are no uh, limitations of what we could use and um it's pretty cheap it's only like five bucks a night for power up at Burdekin, seven dollars per person so it's really good value um but um, yeah, no, it's been been, been a, a really really pleasant um, stay up here for the four or five days, and like I said before, uh, well worth coming up, well worth the uh, the look. Okay, so we'll get the van home, we'll give her a bit of a tub, and uh, get our bearings done, and get ready for an next little trip somewhere. See so how we go. But just a very informative trip. This one, just a um, we'll put a few. Snippets of what we've done in Mount Fox, the crater, the, um, the, the volcano, which is the youngest one in Australia. And um, yeah, so uh, go from there. Okay, happy Easter, everybody. Mm -hmm.